Hi, this is Lisa Ridges. Welcome to the studio. Uh, today I'm finishing up a landscape. It's been on the go for a couple of weeks now. Uh, back and forth. I've probably had five or six sessions on this piece by now. Um, building up the layers. I use a lot of glaze in my landscapes and that's what gives me that oil feel, that translucent feel. It builds up the depth um, in the piece and allows the translucency and the vibrance to sort of simulate oils without having to deal with the the dry time of oils and the fumes etc. I know that there are some open acrylics now and some, some other products that aren't quite as smelly but um, I'm used to working with acrylics so I'm just going to go ahead and put literally the final touches on this running some very subtle color across already mixed in with glaze wiping it back out again so that it isn't too um, in your face and, and then it pushes back into the existing painting and literally just here and there picking out a few details I'm really happy with how the piece turned out um, and I'll show you the reference that I was working from which is actually um, a digital uh, mash, I call them dig digital mashes of my photography uh, which was taken back in Wisconsin I think um, and some digital layovers um, and working in Photoshop and Procreate. Uh, it doesn't look exactly like the reference but it gave me a good place to start from uh, and a good roadmap if you will as to what I wanted to achieve and the feel of it. I think I'm, I'm pretty pleased with it. I've made a few palette shifts along the way um, and a few decisions where I've had some some really nice mark making that's come out that hasn't been exactly pre-planned it's knowing what to keep and what not to keep at that point um, so I haven't stuck to the reference religiously I find that when I do that I can get really fussy um, and the painting suffers for it so I've sort of gone with the flow a little bit and allowed spontaneous things to happen which I think for me at least, improves my painting. Um, so it's not really based on a specific location, this piece. It's more so about atmosphere uh, for me and uh, letting the viewer decide a few things and, and get involved in the painting, not spelling it out for you. So I've added in some of my uh, rust quinacridone color here and just hit the bottom of the painting. And uh, I really just think it's done. I'll, I'll just back away. I'll take another look tomorrow to make sure um, that there's no areas that need touching up, but I think it's done.